Now we are doing exercise 3.2 question number 5. Question number 5, let me write down the question. So, so that the points A, B, C, D are vertices of a parallelogram and find the length of its diagonal. So there are, there is a thing called like this, there is a diagram and A, B, C, D and A is 4 comma 3, B it is 1 comma 2, C it is 1 comma 0 and D it is 4 comma 1. We need to find, we need to prove that all these are the points of a diagonal. So here a b is equal to root over so a and b so this will be x1 y1 x2 y2 so formula is x1 minus y1 so 4 minus 1 whole square plus y1 minus y2 that is 3 minus 2 3 minus 2 whole square which will be root over 4 minus 1 it is 3 3 square plus 3 minus 2 it is 1 square 3 to the 9 plus 1 which will be equal to root over 10 let us find out bc now now b a b and wait wait this is the wrong way of writing a b and this will be c and this will be d so c is 1 comma 0 and d is 4 comma 1 so now b and c will be equal to now now we are going to take this as x1 y1 and this is x2 y2 right so bc will be equal to root over x1 minus x2 that will be 1 minus 1 whole square plus y1 minus y2 that is 2 minus 0 whole square which will be equal to root over 1 minus 1 it is 0 square plus 2 minus 2 it is 2 square 2 square and root so which will be root 2 square square root cancel which will be equal to 2 now bc also done now we need to find out cd cd will be equal to root over cd so this line it will be equal to root over if i write down here x1 y1 x1 y1 and this will be x2 y2 x1 minus x2 so it will be 1 minus 4 1 minus 4 whole square plus y1 minus y2 that is 0 minus 1 whole square which will be equal to root over 1 minus 4 it is minus 3 whole square plus 0 minus 1 it is minus 1 square which minus 3 squared it will be 3 to the 9 plus minus 1 squared it will be 1 so root over 9 plus 1 it will be equal to root over 10 and cd now we need to find out a d or d a anyway so let us find out ad so x1 y1 x2 y2 so root over x1 minus x2 that is 4 minus 4 whole square plus ad this that's why y1 minus y2 that is 3 minus 1 whole square so 4 minus 4 it is 0 square plus 3 minus 2 2 square so root over 2 square square and root cancel it will be equal to 2 i hope you don't find it much difficult and i hope you know the previous question so it is quite easy not that difficult here so now we can see here a b and c d are equal and b c and a d are equal so a b it is root 10 and d c also it is root 10 and this is 2 and this is 2 opposite sides are equal right so since a b is equal to c d and b c is equal to a d <coughs> <coughs> sorry for that so now since this are equal so a b and c d are equal and b c and a d are equal so therefore therefore the points points are that of a parallelogram okay now what else they are asking find the length of each diagonals okay find the length of each diagonal so our points are the vertices vertices of 
parallelogram. Okay, fine. So we need to find the diagonal. Diagonal means we need to find BD. So so now so what are the diagonals? One 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 is AC. Another one is BD. This one. So let us find out AC. So now AC is equal to a is 4 3 and c is 1 0 so ac so here it is 4 3 and let me run this x2 y2 so x1 it is 4 x2 it is 1 so 4 minus 1 whole square plus 3 y1 is 3 and y2 is 0 so 3 minus 0 whole square which will be equal to 4 minus 1 it is 3 square plus 3 minus 0 it is 3 square so 3 to the 9 plus 3 to the 9 which will be root over 18 or we can write down this one as 3 into 3 into 2 3 to the 9 into 2 which will be 3 root 2 we can write down like this also and next we need to find out we have found out ac now we need to find out bd so bd will be equal to root over so what is b and d x1 y1 and x2 y2 so x1 is 1 1 minus x2 is 4 so 1 minus 4 whole square plus 2 2 minus 1 so 2 minus 1 whole square so this one which will be equal to 1 minus 4 it is minus 3 whole square plus 2 minus 1 it is 1 square 3 square it is 3 to the 9 plus 1 which will be equal to root over 9 plus 1 it is 10 okay we got ac that is 3 root 2 and we got bd that is root over 10 okay so therefore diagonals are 3 root 2 and root 10 okay that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video